everybody. My name is Chris. Today I am going to read the Bible story. The Bible time. 31 chapter. The brave queen Esther. Ham Haman is going to kill the people of Israel. Uncle Mordecai said to the queen Esther, What do you want me to do? said Esther. Haman will say, <gasps> Haman is going to kill, going to kill the people of Israel. Uncle Mordecai said, the queen Esther, what do you want me to do? Said Queen Esther. I think they will, like, Mordecai will say, like, this. Please ask the king to help us, Esther says the most kind but Esther could couldn't go it. Esther called go to King only. Esther could go to King only when he wanted. Esther was an Israel. He was the queen of the Persian King Jersey, Mordecai was a grounded and the gate. Haman was the king's coffer chief helper. He wanted to, he helped, hated the Israel. He didn't know the queen was an Israel. He planned to kill the people of Israel. I don't want to die, said Esther. But Esther loved her people. Queen Esther went to King Xerxes without his permission. The king welcomed her. King, the king loved her. King Jersey promised Esther to do anything for her. Please help my people, said the Esther. A bad person is going to kill my people. He is trying to kill me. The king didn't like it. The King loved Esther. King told Haman to stop it. No, I think I think I will make some more line. Haman is going to kill my person. Uh, Haman Haman is going to kill my people. He is trying to kill me. I think he'll say like that, right? Then he knew that Haman is going to do kill Esther. The king didn't like it. The king loved Esther. The king told Haman to stop it. Queen Esther saved her people. Esther and her people were not scared anymore. They were happy because of the brave Queen Esther. I think the picture has gone came the, not good because that person was Haman. <laughs> then the little boy little boy next. That person is Haman and Haman is doing <laughs> 32 chapter unchallenging love of God. Job was a godly man. He served God. He didn't want God. Did what God wanted. God blessed him. Sad thing happened to Job's servant. <laughs> happened. Job's servant ran to him. Mad people took our livestock. Job was sad. I think he was very really sad. Another servant came to Job. They killed the 
remaining Liston. They killed all the servants. I think he was even more sad. The other servant ran to Job. Your sons all died. Job was very sad. Job prayed it to God in tears. Naked, I am from my mother's womb. Naked, I will depart. The Lord gave, and the Lord took away from me. I praise the Lord. I think Satan was doing like that. Satan was doing bad thing to Job, and. Job was praising the Lord, and I think Satan will be like, I didn't think this. <laughs> In spirit of all these things, Job didn't sin or complain to God. Job became sick after that. Satan did all these things to Job. Satan wanted to Job go away from God, but Job didn't go away from God. I will love God no matter what. I will also always love God, said Job. Job loved God even in despair. Job was only by the seven more. Job came to know more about God when he was suffering. Soon God healed him. Job was in sadness and pain, but he didn't leave God. God gave Job more cows, more sheep. God also gave him ten children. <gasps> ten children, I think Job will a little bit be mm -mm. tired. Because they will, I am hungry, I am tired, I want to play. 33rd chapter. Daniel imparted the, the king's dream. King Nebuchadnezzar of Babylon was afraid. I had a dream, but I don't understand the meaning of the dream. The king gathered many people. The king asked them to impart the meaning of the dream. Impart my dream, said. Impart my dream, said the king. How can I know about your dream, said the people. The king didn't like their answer. If you can, can't impart my dream, I will kill you. People were trembling with fear. I think king was very mad <laughs> that time. Daniel was, was God mad. Daniel said to king, I will impart your impart the dream for you. Daniel prayed it to God. What is the meaning of the dream? Please give me wisdom, God. God told Daniel what is the dream was about. Thank you for letting me know the meaning of the dream. Something fell down. Daniel told the king about the dream. Nobody could explain the dream. The Daniel, oh my God, that is fate. Sacrificed. The king was afraid of Daniel's God. The king was surprised by Daniel's wisdom. The king placed him in a high 
person. The king gave him many gifts. The king left Daniel ruler over Babylon. The king made Daniel a teacher for every wise man. Daniel thanked God for helping him. Yes, I read the story. Today I'm going to revise the story. I'll give you two questions in each story. I'll in Queen Esther who was going to kill the Israel tick tick one tick tick two tick tick three tick tick four tick tick five tick tick six tick tick seven tick tick eight tick tick nine tick tick ten the answer is Haman and in Esther, sorry, who saved the Israel people? Tick tick one, tick tick two, tick tick three, tick tick four, tick tick five, tick tick six, tick tick seven, tick tick eight, tick tick nine, tick tick ten. The answer was Esther. Esther saved the people of Israel. Now, this story I will tell you. On Chan gaining love of God. I'll give you two questions. Okay, first letter. Who made him sad? Make him bad thing? Like killing some bad people came and killed the sheep, like those things. Who did like that? Bad people, but who said to do to the bad people? No, this is not a good question. Did the bad people kill the sheep? Tick tick one, tick tick two, tick tick three, tick tick four, tick tick five, tick tick six, tick tick seven, tick tick eight, tick tick nine, tick tick ten. Answer is no, because in the story, it is written, God, bad people has taken the ship. Like here. They take, they take it, all of them. Okay. Like cow, sheep, they take it. And I'll tell you. When bad thing happened to dog, did did job complain or then he didn't pray to Lord? Yes or no? Tick tick one, tick tick two, tick tick three, tick tick four, tick tick five, tick tick six, tick tick seven, tick tick eight, tick tick nine, tick tick ten. Answer is no, he didn't left God. So strange. Daniel into the king's dream. When the wise people say, I don't I cannot tell you the meaning of the dream. How can I do? How can I know? When the wise man said like that, what did king do? 
what the kings say. Tick tick one, tick tick two, tick tick three, tick tick four, tick tick five, tick tick six, tick tick seven, tick tick eight, tick tick nine, tick tick ten. The answer is I will kill you when you do he didn't like that answer, so he was saying whenever person cannot say this and you say this meaning of the dream, I will kill he said like that. Yes, today I read the Bible story and I gave you the five questions. It was fun then bye.